Well done, ladies. You're good. That last rehearsal was spectacular. Don't let these tools fool you. I'm a grafter. These hands work hard. This brain's always thinking, and it never shuts down. Is that ready? You guys can do this. Everyone knows if you ask me to do something, it doesn't matter how great the task is, nothing's beyond me. This is it. This is the real thing. Hi, Dragons. Really excited to be here. My name is Chika Russell, and I'm founder of Chika Foods, a taste of the exotic. I'd like to ask you for £30,000 in exchange for 5% equity stake in the business. Chika's produces a range of luxurious West African-inspired snacks. These are the foods of my childhood. Long summer days spent in Nigeria, running around fields, the village women toasting nuts, rich and robust in flavour, us trying to catch a nut, burning our hands in the process. Chika's range of products includes our signature hand-toasted peanuts. They're dried beneath the African sun before toasting. Makes them delicious. Our range also includes our distinctive and rich flavoured plantain crisps, prepared at perfect ripeness to get the balance of sweet and savoury, just a hint of chilli. Chica's launched in February 2014. We've had the pleasure of supplying some of the world's best hotels, high-end retailers. In barely just a year of trading, Chica's is available in over 150 outlets across the UK. We have advanced discussions with Waitrose for launching 130 stores. The point is, Dragons, I know what I'm doing. I'm already doing it, but I can do it better. And with your partnership, Chica's can become an even more successful business and established global brand. Please join me to make this happen. A bold pitch from confident entrepreneur Chica Russell. Thank you, Chiquitas. She's looking for £30,000 to help make her Nigerian food range a household name. So exciting. I can't believe I'm here. On offer in return is just 5% of her company. With the dancing over, time to get down to some serious business. Hi, I'm Sarah. Hi, Sarah. That was brilliant. Thank you. And I love your product. Really love it. I actually think there's a massive market for African food in the UK, and I don't think it's been done. What I want to ask you is, do you see just sticking to these products? Absolutely what? not. Talk me through oh. the vision. OK, so... Oh, I'd love to launch Sweet Potato Crisps. However, when Chica's becomes a brand, what I'd really love to do, I'm a mean cook, and um, I'd love to develop a, a range of dry marinades, because everyone I make, my signature roast chicken, grilled fish, everyone's like, oh, oh, that's good, can I have the recipe? So I end up making mixes in big bowls and putting them into bags and dishing them out to people. I have to say, that the, the impact of the dancers was amazing. Thank it, you. It's almost as if their bottoms are disconnected from their backs. I, know. I just don't how know do how they, they do, do those moves. I taught them. Amazing. I would love to be able to do that move. It's I'll just show you. It's incredible. Can you, can you teach Peter? Um, well, actually, at dinner parties, I'm known to make people do the TikTok. You want to practice the TikTok with me? Come on, Peter. What, have it, a go. Just show the TikTok. I don't know Come what you're So the TikTok, you stand with your legs slightly wide apart, squat slightly, and then you. <laughs> oh, forget. I couldn't even think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Chica's got all the right moves as she proves she has a head for business and ambition for her brand. But Tuka Silliman knows she'll need more than aspiration if she's to choreograph an investment. I like the branding. It's very clean, very precise. Thank you. Um, do you sell any of these back to Nigeria? None at all. None at all? Wow. Oh. The reason for that is because this is Nigerian street food. It's available in Nigeria, but not in this way. It's been changed slightly. 
for the UK market, or for the Western palette, I should say. I have a business, and we make specific types of garments, specifically for the Nigerian market, and I know how big it is. Yes. With, with the population virtually double of the UK, can you imagine exporting this product back to your own country? Of course. A gentleman who deals with distribution in Ghana yep. thought that these would be pr perfect uh, for Ghana. I, so... I've got good contacts in Ghana in this field. Yeah, OK. Chika, hi, I'm Nick. Hi. Um, <clears throat> I think you've got a fantastic product. Um, I love it. Uh, and I'm very impressed with you. Thank so, um, I would like to make you an offer. I would like to make you an offer of all of the money um, for 10% of the business. But I'll tell you what I'm going to add. You've got to build a brand here. I started a brand from zero yes. to, to sort of 90% awareness in, in, in the UK. And I understand a lot that goes with that. I can shortcut quite a lot of things, having been through, seen quite a lot, quite a lot of business and helping guide you through that process. Thank you. Um, so that's my offer. Nick Jenkins wastes no time, jumping in early with an enticing 10% equity deal. Does Deborah Meaden find the proposal as appetising? I think you are extremely, you, you are, I don't think, you're extremely capable. You created something that, that it has got, I do this, you know, it's got something about it. Thank okay. you. So, um, I'm going to make you an offer. I, I'm not going to be as generous as Nick. And I'm going to offer you all of the money. I actually want 20% of the business. Right, OK. Thank you so much. I've got a lot of experience in this. I completely share your vision when you talked about you know I'm a great cook at home and the spices and I can I can really see Chica's as an amazing brand I'd love to go on that journey with you so I'm gonna match Deborah's offer actually which is all of the money for for 20% right. Another two offers on the menu, as food guru Sarah Willingham makes an identical bid to Deborah Meaden. But Peter Jones still wants to drill down further into the prospect on offer. In terms of the size of this market, what is it in the UK? Um, well, the nut market is 400 million. Have you seen Levi Roots' roasted peanuts and nuts? Roasted peanuts, no. I haven't. Not because it's mine, though, are they? What's he, what's he doing? Where doing have you that? been? This is your market. You should know about that. I know. I wasn't aware. God, I thought I was all over Levi Roots. No. When Levi first came here, I could see what could be created. With you, it's even more impactful. You can, you're, you're there, and I can see the speed at which you could do this. So I'm going to make you an offer for all of the money, but I'm going to ask for 25%. A fourth bid, and from a dragon with global food brand form. Will Tuka Suleiman also think Chica's business is worth shelling out on? Chica, um, the one thing I can give you is Tuka time, <laughs> right? I think you need more than 30,000. I'm going to make you an offer. I'm going to give you 40,000. I'm going to give you a 30,000 pound credit facility to grow. But what I want for that, so that we can be real partners, I want 30%. But what you will have is you'll have me as we grow together. I have got great contacts, and I think you and I can make that journey together, and we'll be a great team. Chica's in a commanding position as a full House of Dragons bid for her business. But their equity demands of 10, 20, 25 and 
a way out of the 5% ballpark Chica originally offered. Um, well, I didn't actually expect that response, <laughs> so I'm slightly confused. Um, but would any of you consider a reduction in percentage you're asking for? Because that's probably what's going to make me um, be my deciding factor. Um, so, we've been a bit stubborn today. Um, what do you want? Tell us what you want. I'd like to bring on two dragons. The maximum I'd like to give away the business is 25%. Don't forget that Deborah and I offered, and Nick actually, offered less than you're willing to give away. Yes, I, I wanted two dragons. Oh, okay. That's, that's one of the things I... You, you, don't, you need you, to you, think hard about that. You do, you I do don't think you I, need I'm, two getting, I'm getting a little bit concerned here because I made you a very good offer and I really valued your business. Yeah. And I'm wondering why you were even thinking about this. Well, because your expertise, as you mentioned, uh, marketing, and that's great. A Nick. critical part of growing this business. But I feel that Chica's needs uh, a, a list of contacts as well. I, Sarah, I wonder... You've got a lot of really valuable food experience. I've got a lot of very valuable online branding experience. I mean, I'd be delighted to share this with you. Would do, that work for you, if you had me and Nick? At a total at 25%, mm. between the two of us. OK. I'd be willing to share with Deborah or Peter. But our percentage is way out, way out of the ballpark. I mean, we're looking at a combination of 20%. You're, even if well, you went at 20%, okay. it's way beyond I'd anything. be willing to go put up half the money for 12.5%. 12.5%? 12 12 yes. I'm not, I'm not going in at 12.5%. I'm being very clear. I, I don't need to... I don't want to share with another dragon this opportunity. Yep. All five dragons have offered Chica the cash she needs, but the array of complicated deals on the table means she'll need to give up anywhere between 10% and 30% of her business. This confusing free-for-all of offers has only left her with more questions. Do you all have contacts in other countries to help this um, business be global? Absolutely. Certainly, we, I think we all in trade, trade internationally. OK. Um, do you have the network in other countries to place it in the shops, as you could do here? Uh, I instance? have a network in Turkey. OK. 80 million people. OK. All right, thank you. Chica, I think it's time to make your mind up. I know, I'm sorry. I don't want to put any pressure on, but I, I'm just, you know, a little bit... That's it, Nick. I, I'm be, That's I, it. Let, let, let her decide. OK. I think, I'm I sorry, think we've, we've um, you didn't say your position on the whole uh, contacts in other countries, did you? No, I don't think so. Do you know what? I'm about to say I, those two words, Chica. Yeah. And I know that this might mean that you're not going to choose me, but do you know what? You need to make the decision, because okay. it's getting frustrating. I'm going to go with Peter. Oh, oh, Finally, a deal. As Chica decides Peter Jones is the man for the job, a partner in her company. I'm so sorry about that. I no, well, yeah, done. No, well done. Well done. So business happy is full for of you. decisions. Thank well you. Done. Thank bye. you. Bye. Chica leaves the den with the £30,000 she came in for, but has given up a 25% slice of her business to Peter Jones. You've got a great, you a great investment. Thank you. I have ever seen somebody take control of the floor like that. Good. At Good one on point, it. she had five dragons pitching to her. She's incredibly yeah. impressive. Great. great. What can I say? I mean, <sighs> um, as Nigerians would say, I came to collect and I collected. So I got what I came for. I feel good, do, 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 do. I knew that I would.